Hello, my name is Annette Burks. I'm a realtor in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, and I'm going to be assisting Candace Parker and her mom, Sharon Parker, with purchasing her first home. Hi, I'm Candace Parker. I'm 27 years old, and I'm in the mortgage industry. And this is my mom, Sharon Parker. She's been hand-in-hand -hand with me through this whole experience of finding a home. Okay, ladies. It was such a delight working with you, too. But I must say, I am so happy <laughs> this experience is over <laughs> and with success because we did find you a house, Candace. Yes, we did. I'm glad. Yes. I didn't know if it was going to be possible. You know, your daughter, she does have champagne taste with a beer budget. Yes. So it was very difficult. <laughs> we, had, we had a few challenges here yes. and there. But overall, you got the house that you want. You're happy, right? Yes, I'm very happy. I, I can't believe that I got through this whole process because I thought it would never end. Mm -hmm. Just as long as we've been looking at houses and all those MLSs or just... The pictures would show one thing, and then you get to the house, it's totally different. it looks totally different. That is just so disappointing. It's like, oh, another one bites the dust. Right. Move it on. <laughs> so I am so glad now she's found what she wanted, mm -hmm. and I'm so happy too. Although, yeah. she didn't really get what I really wanted. I was looking more for her to have a split level home. Why split level? Because then when she gets settled later on and she have a family, it'll be a house of her future. More than just what she has right now. No. <laughs> just a little. <laughs> She's looking at future. I'm looking at what's going on present day. So yeah. I like to entertain. I like to have people over. I want an open floor plan. Single family home. Just, you know, single story. Three bedrooms, two baths. Backyard for the dogs. That right. was going to be a really big thing for me. And that was it. Because I, I was very particular about not only the single story it being, you know, no stairs, that type of thing. But I wanted, wanted that French style. Wanted that grandness from the outside. I also wanted a modern twist a little bit with it too. Because I like to stay trendy. Keep it, you know, all looking chic and stylish in the inside. What did she call it? French style? French style? Yes. Yeah, I yes. think that was a term yes. you used yes. French style with a modern <laughs> In America. Twist. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> with a modern twist. That's yes. how I wanted it. Uh -huh. So I was, I mean, at least I knew what kind of, kind, of, kind of style house that I wanted. Right. right. And then, of course, we had to look for the big kitchen because she loves to cook, thanks to me. Yes. That's right, thanks to you. Entertaining dinner yes. parties. That's what I was keeping in mind. Yes, yes, yes. So you found your dream, so that is awesome. For today, and then uh, maybe in a few years, Mom, when yes. she's ready to yes. venture out into the relationship world and and that at, that level, at that level. At that level. Right. Yes. She'll get the home <laughs> that you're looking for, right? Yeah, so I guess we'll just be satisfied with my granddogs for now. Yes. Until. <laughs> okay. What was the house hunting experience like? The house hunting experience has been a range of different emotions from being overwhelming to pretty much mostly stressful because it took time to go and look at these houses and then we would get the pictures and then we'd be just hyped about the pictures and be like, oh, this looks so nice. And then you get to the house and it's just like, you see the one picture that showed those rooms, but all the other areas were like, horrible right. like it was old or maybe it wasn't taken care of or even from like towel colors to paint colors to I mean the odors smell, I know, I know. it would dogs, just be pets. all kinds of stuff so um it, it was just up and down and get it really excited because I'm you know getting my first house right. but then you know it was kind of disappointing and a little bit stressful when I wasn't finding what I wanted I understand Mom, what do you think? What Candy is saying is true, but I want to really highlight the word challenge because although the houses did have their different, you know, good things and bad things, Candace can definitely be a challenge because she is very picky. 
Hey, I know what I want. Well, yeah, I know you know what you want. <laughs> but on the flip side, too, I think that we were looking on two different levels. Mm -hmm. Because I was looking more of the future and what I felt she should have. And she had a whole different thought. So we kind of clashed on that. Yeah, I agree with you because uh, I can remember numerous times throughout the conversation, you're saying family, she's saying friends and partying and entertaining and you're saying split level for family and so yes i, I definitely agree with you i yeah. do see uh, yes. where the challenge lies but we do appreciate you being a part of it because you brought tons of insight yes uh, yes. to the whole experience for candace yes. and i used some of her her ideas and information uh -huh. yes. i was able to use it <laughs> yes and then also you know we are a cooking family you know i like to cook so one thing that she did really listen to me on was the kitchen so mm -hmm. i'm glad that you know the house that she chose does have a big kitchen for entertaining so for family and friends okay so let's talk about some of the deal breakers you had quite a few on your list yes a lot i had a lot but i was able to compromise with some things at least i thought but right. in the end no so um deal breakers pretty much old homes 80s 90s did not like. Mm -hmm. um, I was used to apartment living. If, if someone was broke, I picked up the phone and the maintenance came out and fixed it. Mm -hmm. So I wasn't trying to get into a home that needed a lot of repairs, right. um, that needed major changes or upgrades. So that automatically kicked those 80s, 90s style houses, wood paneling, oh, yeah. just older homes to the curb because that was not what I was looking for. What about you, Mom? What were some of the deal breakers for you? Yeah, I can I can definitely agree with Candy when it came to the older home. Mm -hmm. uh, as far as the uh, paneling, some of the fixtures, some of the styling of the old home, they wasn't as open planned it mm -hmm. as that's what she wanted. You know, right. sometimes even the size was bigger than what we wanted because they were older, mm -hmm. depending on who the builder was. I didn't want was. too much to clean. Yes, exactly. Yes, yes. <laughs> enough that I could handle. Mm -hmm. Yes. And so, you know, just looking at that, I can really understand why she wanted a certain time period of the home that she was looking for, definitely. Let's talk about um, the dogs and the accommodation for them. I yes. know that was one of the uh, challenges we had. It was a big thing. I, like I said, you know, apartment living. I've been living in apartments for the last five years. So when I decided to get a house, it was also for the dogs because they can have their own backyard right. we, you know having pets I would have to leash them up you know a couple times a day and just walk them to the nearest grass patch and it's gonna be a wonderful, wonderful for me at least to just be able to open up a back door and let them run and play and uh, have their own backyard as well as them I, right. I know that they're gonna enjoy it okay Candace I have to tell you this I think what I enjoy the absolute most about the experience of helping you find a home was just this huge diva personality that yes, you have. Yes, I'm a diva. <laughs> I mean, even down to the fine detail. Yes. French doors leading to your master bedroom. Yes, that was a must. And when you walk in the house, I wanted it to look grand. I wanted to, you to feel like you were in this gorgeous house owned by this beautiful woman. That's what, I, that's what I really wanted. I did. I wanted you to have that feel. So there was a lot of things in the house, French doors specifically. That's just my master bed. That's my wing. That's my area. And it also opens up from my bedroom to my bathroom. So that's where I keep I, I love it. I mean, it's like so sex in the city. Yes. You know, I, I just think about <laughs> Carrie Bradshaw. Bradshaw. Yes. As yes, soon as you exactly. said that, I was like, oh my gosh. Open doors. Yes. Yes. That, that is perfect, though. And then we <laughs> made sure we had the stone um, rock on the outside of the house because that was all about her glamour yes. of walking it, it the curb appeal. The grandness. Yes. Grandness. <laughs> so why should I be on House Hunters? Because I'm young, I'm single. And I've been in the mortgage industry for quite a while. And I've seen a lot of couples, families, you know, get these houses. And I feel like, why can I, why can I not get a house? I feel like I can share my story with a lot of maybe single women out there that could be a little intimidated with the whole home buying process. And sure enough, it is a big commitment, but I'm ready for it. Plus, I got it like that. I'm a diva. I'm here. Do you want to be on House Hunters? 